what's up guys welcome back to another video on my channel and today I'm gonna be teaching you guys how to wheelie make sure you guys stick around till the end of the video because you guys are gonna need all the steps to take you to the next level to get that wheel up so remember guys this goes for any bike if you got a road bike mountain bike BMX this goes for any bike so step number one guys you're gonna want to make sure that your rear brakes are working properly this is gonna prevent you from falling and looping out second you're gonna want to make sure that you guys raise your seat up raise your seat up so that it's more comfortable to wheelie when you raise your seat up it makes your balance point more lower so you don't have to bring the bike up as high third step guys you guys are going to want to make sure you guys wear a helmet wear knee pads whatever it's going to prevent you guys from getting injured and it's also going to make a little it's going to create a little uh, fear barrier for you guys so you'll be less scared to fall when you have your protective gear on so next step you're going to want to find your most dominant foot so you're going to find out which foot you pop the bike up with which foot you're most comfortable popping the bike up with and just getting used to hitting your rear brake so what i like to do guys i like to i call it the three pedal count method one two see that third pedal is going to be a that's what i'm going to pop the bike up All right, so three pedals, lean forward. On the third pedal, lean forward. On the third one, you're gonna lift the bike up, hit the brake, and keep doing that over and over again. It's okay to loop the bike out. It's okay to bring it back too far. It's better if you guys bring the bike back further than to, than to do one of these. Cause if you, if you keep, if you do this, oh sorry if you if you guys do that and you oh you loop the brake it's just gonna get you guys more comfortable of where the bike needs to actually be and when you guys are gonna want to hit the brake so three pedals in one two three lean forward lean back hit the brake it's that easy all you guys need to do if you're having trouble with with lifting the bike up high just it's all about the it's all about your weight you also need to throw your weight back as you hit the pedal just throw your weight back there but also just remember to hit that brake every time you do so so look one two three lift that hit the brake as soon as i feel like the bike's about to loop out i'm hitting that brake like there's no question about it it's it's gonna become muscle memory to you guys to hit that rear brake Okay, so once you guys are comfortable popping the bike up, getting used to that rear brake, now you guys are gonna start adding in some pedals and starting to hit the brake a little lighter. So we're gonna still use that three pedal count method. So one, two, three, and you just just try to keep pedaling. Instead of hitting, instead of just smashing the brake, one, two, three, instead of just hitting the brake, because now you guys are getting comfortable with hitting the brake, so now you're gonna try to hit the brake a little bit lighter and try to pedal through it as well. So I'm gonna show you guys. So one, two, three, brake, brake, brake. You guys watch my brake finger. I'm hitting that brake, but I'm still pedaling through it. And as long as you guys are pedaling, that's gonna come along with the balance. So you gotta keep pedaling when you lift your bike up. If you feel like your balance is getting thrown off side to side, because you got to keep that that those feet moving so one two three pop it up hit the brake you know it's okay it's okay to hit the brake and it's, it's gonna drop but you just got to get used to hitting it lighter and pedaling through your brakes so just watch my brake finger because it doesn't look like i'm hitting brake you know it's just once you're in that balance point you're in that balance point you know <laughs> guys this is the easiest way to learn i'm telling you guys this is the easiest way to learn if you guys want to learn it as quick as possible you gotta just stay at it all day oh, 
one, two, three, brakes. And guys, it's always good to start off slow too. You don't need to go fast, but I can tell you with more speed, you do get more balance. So practice off first going slow so that you guys learn your brakes. And then once you guys are comfortable with the brake, you start adding some more speed. And with speed comes more control. So that's it for today's video guys if you guys found this video helpful make sure to leave a like if you guys are new to the channel hit that subscribe button i'll see you guys on the next one